the team of the year. Team of the year officially dropped. And I gotta say, it's a weird year for team of the year. If you guys are familiar with the team of the year promo, they basically just deck out a ton of players who had amazing seasons with 96 or 97s. Usually this is just determined by EA and it's most of the players that are really, really good, but not gonna get an NFL award. So for example, you might think Cooper Cup should be a team of the year wide receiver, but Cooper Cup is probably gonna get offensive player of the year. So he doesn't get a team of the year card. What EA tried to do this year was they wanted to let the community vote on team of the year. As much as EA is shitty, the community, <laughs> they left it up to a vote. So naturally a bunch of sweaty losers coded a bunch of bots that would vote for them. So literally in the span of like five minutes, they could put in like 400 votes. So every team of the year player this year was actually decided by a bunch of sweaty dungeon dwellers. Let's be nice. It's still sick, like I love the team of the year promo, but honestly, you're gonna look at some of these players and you're gonna be like, like what? That is a team of the year player? Luckily, EA was smart and they pulled out their trump card and usually they don't do this, but this year they did a limited edition player of the year is what they called it. Because I think, I think Debo Samuel was not gonna get a team of the year card, but EA was like, fuck, these sweaty losers cheated this thing. So now we have to put Debo in somehow. The one thing we're gonna pull right now is the 96 overall team of the year fantasy pack. This is so that we can see all the team of the year players. This will be everybody not named Debo Samuel in the pack animation. That's what I was looking for. It's absolutely nasty. And like here, right out the gates. How did Darren Waller get team of the year tight end? Darren Waller didn't hardly do shit this year. I love Darren Waller. I think he's super talented. And I'm grateful for this because I get to pack a punch him on Wheel of Mud. I get this Darren Waller. But bro, he hardly even played this year. Like what? Also, oh, wait a second. Oh shit. Bro, I thought this was all the team of the year players. This is only out of three. Well, shit, getting Darren Waller is sick then. Darren Waller, Jeremy Chin, and... Ken and, and that was the other one, bro. That was the other one. Why does Kenyon Drake have a team of the year hat back? Like what? Also, not to mention EA, this is embarrassing as fuck. I'm on an Xbox Series X. Look at how laggy this is, bro. It, it's like I'm playing this game on a fucking toaster. This is the most expensive, most powerful Xbox you can have and it's unplayable. <laughs> So since all the team of the years are in packs and Debo is the limited and there's no actual team of the year, you know, packs, I'm gonna open the 12 times playoffs bundle and hopefully we can find Debo in here somewhere. We also could end up getting Debo halfback, which would actually be cool either way. So, and a huge thank you to DraftKings Sportsbook for sponsoring today's video. As you guys know, the NFL playoffs are here and DraftKings Sportsbook, an official sports betting partner of the NFL is kicking things off with a huge offer. Counting down to Super Bowl 56, new customers can get 56 to 1 odds on any wild card team to win their game. Bet just $5 and win $280 in free bets if your team is victorious. I know it sounds too good to be true, but it isn't. Bet just $5 on any NFL playoff game and DraftKings Sportsbook is going to give new customers an additional $280 in free bets if the team you bet on wins. And if Sportsbook isn't available in your state yet, don't worry, we have some awesome stuff for you as well. Everyone can play for huge cash prizes with DraftKings Daily Fantasy Football Contests. And DraftKings is giving all new customers a free shot at over a million dollars in prizes with their first deposit. So download the DraftKings Sportsbook app now, use my promo code MMG, and get 56 to 1 odds now on any NFL team. Bet just $5 and win $280 in free bets if your team wins. Again, that's promo code code MMG at DraftKings Sportsbook, an official sports betting partner of the NFL. Let's see what these packs have. And then we also have training to use for sure to get some guaranteed team of the year players. I'll probably just quill, quick sell everything that's shitty. Micah Hyde. Like, look at this. Half my players' card arts aren't even loading. I got these, like, default no names. Landry Darby, sure. I guess I'll take it. Ugh. Can't even see card art on anybody. This issue is Xbox only. PlayStation runs perfectly fine. But, like, if it makes the game unplayable, then fucking take it out. Why is this in the game? An 84, 85, Robinson. Scary Terry, what's this animation? Wait a second. Oh, it has the light and dark animation both for 88s. Dude, I haven't pulled anything better than an 88. That is embarrassing. There's gotta be, okay, I'll take a platinum player, I guess. I'm a little bit upset. 
Okay, Grady Jarrett, Michael Vick, a Team of the Week Tyree Kill, and a kick. I am excited to see the Team of the Year cards, though. I know there's a Pollard. I have the Pollard. Okay, Vernon Butler. I will take it. That's what we need it right now. All right, clean. Christian Kirk, Roger Craig, Agba, and Zay Jones. I have one more fantasy back left. We did, we at least pulled 193. So that'll be a lot of training to grab more players. Take whatever we can get there, I suppose. And a 90 Le'Veon Bell. Finally got something that was an 88. I think we're guaranteed 294s. And I think most likely I'm just going to quick sell both of them. One of these could be Hatback Debo. If one of these is Hatback Debo, I'm keeping them. Come on, baby! Hey, Mike Evans. I actually kind of want to use that too. Debo, Debo, Debo Hatback. Debo Hatback. Come on, baby. Come on! <laughs> Corey Littleton. I will quick sell him. I'm, I'm, I'm not interested in having that. The good thing is the team of the year players are in the training store. So let's quick sell some stuff, get some training, and grab a few of those. So as of right now, we have Darren Waller as a threat. And honestly, you guys have seen me use Darren Waller a lot. So let's find some new stuff. I'll go with a specialist. Specialist always has weird stuff in it too. So I'm excited. As long as it's not a putter kicker, I'll actually be really excited. Javon Hargrave. What was this for? What specialist is this? I guess I'm confused on how a D tackle is a specialist. Interesting. I'm actually going to go with another specialist. I want to get like part return, kick return or something. That would actually be nasty. Come on, baby. What do we got? Okay. Fuck me. I'll quick sell any dupes and then just open another pack. Slowly burn through all our training, but it should be fun. And I don't think Debo is in these packs. God, that animation is actually sick, though. I do love the animation! And we get Pollard! Spoiler alert, of, in a video tomorrow, you will see Pollard. You'll see a lot of Pollard. I'm gonna quick sell Pollard as well. If I get Hargrave or Pollard here, I'm actually gonna be really depressed. Come on, baby! Something else! Anything else? <laughs> If this is Pollard, I'm done with specialists. It's a kicker. I guess I don't mind a kicker. I do mind a kicker. I don't give a shit about a kicker. All right, let's try this a little different way. Let's go team of the year defense. I wonder if Michael Parsons is on this. I feel like he wouldn't be because he'd get defensive rookie of the year. This is the Denzel Ward that I just fucking quick sold. Oh my God. You'll also see Denzel Ward in tomorrow's video too. That's why I'm doing this. And literally the only thing it can't be is Denzel Ward. Like that's the only player it can't be. Team of the Air defense, there's so much. What do you got? Hey, I love Fred Warner. Fred Warner's gonna be a beast. 91 speed, 93 excel, six foot three, 230. Monster. This is block shed. That's gonna really tell me how good this card is. Block Shed is, oh, it's 89. If that was more like 92, this card would be fucking elite. Team of the Year offense, you know, I hate to say it, but I actually wouldn't mind like a left tackle, right tackle. But hey, I'd also take a wide receiver. I'll take Justin Jefferson. Herbert! I'm using that absolutely in today's episode. Damn, let's go. Justin Herbert. I was gonna use my Tebow, but you know what? Fuck it, I'll use Herbert. Team of the Year offense again, we've got... Yes! Yes! I'm so glad I quick soul Pollard, dude. Our offensive pickups are nasty. Let's go back to defense. Maybe I'll try one more specialist defensively. Harrison Smith. He probably won't get any playing time. But maybe I can find a spot for him. Another team of the year defensive player is... Trayvon Diggs. Maybe the most overrated corner of all time. But I'm not gonna ask any questions. And you know what? He's got a 96 overall, so fuck it. Let's get it. Team of the year defense. What else we got? So, I didn't know he had a card. That's gonna be sick. I think last one, we're going to go offense because we got Diggs, Fred Warner, Sertan. Now we got Justin Herbert, Patterson, and our final team of the year pack is... Oh. <laughs> It really is crazy to get dupes as much as I am. Because there's five offensive linemen, tight end, three wide receivers, a fullback. It's just weird that I'm getting that many dupes, but... I literally said I want a left tackle. Asking you shall receive. We get a left tackle. Whitworth. Let's get it. Maybe I'll give some players a few abilities, but I'm not going to lie. I'm actually scared of my app crashing right now. Can't load anything right now. It's so embarrassing. I'm going to give Patterson Jukebox. That's really all I think I need on him. He's already so good. Look at the stats on Patterson here. 95 speed, 94 excel. Sheesh. Hey, he's a demon already, dude. I don't got to do shit to this card. All right, bad. So offensively, Whitworth, Darren Waller. Nice to see him finally getting an upgrade for my Wheel of Mutt. We got Mike Evans, that wide receiver, Cooper Cup, DK Metcalf. And then uh, Patterson, Pollard, Justin Herbert, Fred Warner, Javon Hargrave, Diggs, Sertan. Yeah. 
This team is absolutely loaded. Well, if the game will let me play, it will actually load in. I will be super happy. We got college overtime starting from the 25. This is exactly what should have happened in Chiefs Bills. But we're about to play is what the Chiefs Bills overtime should have looked like. Cam Newton, PJ Williams, Luke Keekley. First and 10. Let's go, Herbie. All right, that's uh. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, what the fuck? He got that shit and it worked, so fuck it. All right, we're gonna go a little play action here. Whoa, oh, Waller, Waller! Shit. You know, I kind of deserve that because I should never, ever have caught that first pass. Oh, I tell her, nice tackle. I'm gonna, I'm gonna press up at the line. I mean, he could just kick a field goal. I think he knows that. Wait, wait! This game ain't over. I respect him for not just taking the field goal and ending it. It's that or he literally didn't know he could kick a field goal, but I have to assume that he was being a cool dude. All right, he's gonna go with the handoff right up the middle. Hendricks in the middle of the field here. I absolutely love him as a user. Second and 10, what do you want here, sir? Might throw underneath to his halfback. Not there. Oh, he sees this? He sees it late. Where are all my players? I have Clowney in here. Ooh, Harrison Smith is my user in the middle, actually. Fourth and 12, it's a big play. No, if I score, it's game over. So I'm gonna look for Metcalf down that seam again. Oh, throw the check down! Oh, I guess Pollard's just the running back. He said fuck it. He does not care who is supposed to be the starter, who is not. But he does run a crispy ass route. No! Switch on, you bum. If he had switched on, I think that could have been a touchdown. But now I'm looking at a third and one. Oh, he's using Watt. Oh, Pollard. He's wide the fuck open. Ooh, oh my god, what a throw. Just barely over the defender. We get a dub. A dub that we really shouldn't have had. He could have kicked that field goal. I didn't see his team, so we're just going to play this out. Wait, what? Wait, wait, whoa, 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 whoa. Bruh. Oh, shit. I accidentally just started a real game. Oh, shit. This is really bad. This is a wheel of mutt game. Well, fuck it. We have to win this now. Oh, I don't have any of my abilities set. Oh, boy. This is not good. All right, boys. You guys are going to have a lot more gameplay with the team of the year than I thought you were going to get. And a lot more intense, too. Shit. I'm not sure what he's going to try and go for here, but Newt's going down. Not losing in this wheel of mutt game. Uh-uh. Okay, I'm, I'm okay with both of these routes. Because neither is particularly open. We stopped Kelsey anyway. Third and 20 fucking seven. Come on, baby. Okay. Ooh. Oh my God. Are you fucking kidding me? Sean Taylor got caught. God. That was so fucking lucky. On third and 27, he converts on a check down. Okay. Hand off. Get rocked. Come on, baby. Another run. Nope. Play action. Yes, sir. Give me that shit. Let's go, Sean T. Stop and go! A fucking wheel of muck game. Come on, baby! You're not built like that. I'm sorry. This is a wheel of muck game, and I have a good team. Oh, this is gonna be so out of order, guys. Okay, if you're watching this video and you watch Wheel of Mutt, I need you to understand something. The next two Wheel of Mutts, I already recorded. I thought Team of the Year was not coming out today, but it came out today. Either way, the next two Wheel of Mutts you see, I won't be discussing this because those two Wheel of Mutts are already recorded. So it won't be until, like, next week that I re-explain all of this, but just watch Wheel of Mutt and enjoy it, baby. That's all you gotta do. It's an easy assignment. Big hit. Oh, he's gonna throw that deep one. Yep. I might blitz here. And then I grab this check down. <sighs> I have no idea how he got that, but he is getting fucking lit up. Go Hargrave on a QB spy. I feel like Hargrave's gotta have some decent speed because he just came out. Ooh. I am more than okay with that. Mine. Throw it. It's mine. Wow! Hell of a check down, honestly! I don't think he expected that to go that way. Fourth and one! Put the game away right here if we get this. Yup! <laughs> Lucky ass! Whatever, get dude. Oh my wow. god, you wow. fucking wow. suck! I have never seen a guy get so fucking bailed. Are you kidding? How you threw that without getting picked and then also broke the tackle? All right, we got it off. That's good news. I kind of like uh, Evans underneath here. Herbert's going to scramble. Boy. That's a bad ball. That's a really bad pass. Ooh. I don't know why I thought that was going to be there, but I had a playmaker that I thought I saw. Throw here. Throw here. Write that shit like a book. Write it like a book. Too easy. All right, let's make better offensive decisions. Ooh. <laughs> oh, holy shit. That Megatron. Good Lord. He almost got to that. See if he goes for it. Yeah, he might go cover it. 
No, he can't. It's just too hard to cover. What a ball from Herbert on the run bullet. Second and 10, I should have great blocks. Yup. Great blocks, what a juke from Pollard. Let's go. You're getting a wheel of mud gameplay. It's not the same as wheel of mud because I don't have a challenge. I didn't get to get amp for this, but whatever. This is as important as a wheel of mud game because it is on my fucking wheel of mud account. All right, so that should be a, an absolute bucket. Waller underneath is actually gonna be really, really open. Oh, he kind of is. Actually, totally fine with that. Not optimal, but a field goal and then a touchdown after half is a two-possession game. What I want is a two-possession game. Oh, that is daylight. We gotta reestablish the run game, bro. Let's get that. Let's get that run game going again. Kind of like the run again. Look at that. Look at the downfield blocking. You think he'll actually bite on the play action here? Because I've ran the ball so much, he might actually. Oh, uh, I can just step up, can't I? Oh, I'm gonna get. <laughs> How is Herbert getting that many yards? No escape artists, no nothing. Oh my God, that was an, an embarrassing attempt to tackle by him in the open field. Go back to the ground, there's Parsons. Yeah, that Parsons is scary, dude. Uh, Jesus Christ. I'm gonna look for Pollard on the right side here after these blocks set up. All right, so there's the blocks. And it, I don't think it was there. 13 to six and our defense is playing very well. And I'm actually kicking pretty well without folks kicker. Kind of a shock. Oh, give it to me. Oh, good decision. Left side run, nope, play action. Oh, there's a, a wide open deep ball. Wait, step out. Oh, he stepped out. I knew it. Sometimes you just get so fucked by that, dude, where they just refuse to stay in bounds. I'm setting the house on play action. The fucking house is coming on him right now. Yup. Get there. Somebody get there. No, nobody gets there, but he's forced to throw a bad ball because we're so in his face. That's huge. He's gonna throw this. <laughs> he went out of bounds! <laughs> Fourth and 16! Let's get there, Odafe. I'm sending Odafe away as well. I want some uh, pressure on the quarterback. He wants to throw McCaffrey. Oh my god, he doesn't. Ooh, he goes down. Cam Newton gets great rushing yards. I don't really know what he's gonna want here. He's gonna throw a sketchy one! Trey Von Diggs! And I shouldn't have brought that out of the end zone. That is his third INT with Cam Newton. Second and 10, same thing though. He leaves the exact same route wide open and Patterson is gonna dig us out of the safety territory. Let's see if uh, Pollard's there again. That's what I'm looking for. Oh, he's on Parsons. He kind of knows where I want to throw. Herbert! <laughs> Sketchy as fuck! I don't care, Herbert, you're a savage, bro. You're such a savage with the game on the line. A crucial moment where you're just gonna dis- Oh, disrespectful. This dive looks so open too. Look at the blocking here. Yep. I think he comes up the mid- oh, Pollard. Pollard. We're gonna show what it- I could've fumbled there too. I just wanna leave no doubt. I wanted this guy to know that he accidentally just got queued up against my Wheel'em Up team. Uh, and he needs to take the L for it. I don't think Evans is there. I'm fucking throwing it. <laughs> Suck up! That was disgusting. Well, that's not open and neither is your post. And he wants to throw this. I think I got two hands on that. I think that should have been an INT. There's the Smith, up the middle, untouched. Oh. He heaves one and wow. He has had so much trouble getting his feet down. Robbie Anderson, that's twice now. <laughs> Dude, it's really working. Oh, just kidding. That's so... <gasps> Why didn't I, I didn't see that? Fourth and 10. He's just rattled. He's rattled. He's fucking rattled. That's it. I mean, it's Ben game, but I'm still gonna throw another touch on him. Just to be a dickhead. I think Pollard should be open. Left side, uh, left side gnarly route. Yup. He's in, man. He could get picked here. All right, he does, he does. All right, that one's on me. There might be something open. Oh, Ramsey! A fucking snag. McCaffrey just got fucking pancaked! And we're gonna stop and go this one? 
Oh, I'm on a clock. <laughs> what a defensive match. It was defense in the run game, which is weird. That's kind of uncharacteristic for me, but I did have two team of the year running backs, Pollard and Patterson, just kind of switching off reps and getting after. I actually, I gotta say, I fucking love that. I love that dual running back way that we played that. I never do that in Wheel of Mutt because I never have two good running backs, but Pollard, seven for 79. Patterson, two for 16 and receiving. You got Pollard, four for 61 and Patterson, two for 15. They both had abilities. They both were getting fucking after it. Herbert, four for 61. Passing, I didn't do a damn thing. I had a 20 QBR. It was 21 to six. We get a dub. Five interceptions for Cam Newton. All right, boys. Well, I hope you fucking enjoy. This is a hell of a pack and play. You're not ever going to get a pack and play like that again. Not on purpose, at least. All right. You will see a wheel of mutt in the future that explains what just happened here. But for now, you can just get fucked. I'm sorry. I love you guys. I hope you enjoyed. Got that fat fucking W, baby. That's all that matters. I'll see you guys in the next episode. Thanks for watching. As always, peace.